Hi guys, Crispin Sanford again. Uh, just reaching out to you all uh, with another message, another tool that I think you you will find very useful. Um, has to do with um, your most demanding clients. Uh, we all have experienced those people who um, have to speak to you, have to get on the phone with you, have to meet with you now. And uh, one of the ways that you can ensure that you turn over that responsibility to a designee right, uh, is to ensure that the, that the person you want to designate the responsibility to joins you on calls and in particular joins you in meetings with that individual uh, and also does the, the immediate follow-up and the ongoing follow-up and is really on top of that follow-up. Um, reason why this is so important is that typically you're a producer, you're running the company, very often involved in closing business, uh, and that's the, the, the lifeblood of the organization, your executive planning, your vision, ensuring that that's being executed uh, and being done, done properly, but also closing deals. You, until you've designated that particular role and function to a sales team, um, then you know, it's very often you. And so if you're taken away from producing, from leading, from running the organization, from bringing in uh, particularly high-end tickets, high-end sales, um, then that takes away from the lifeblood of the organization. And really, um, answering calls, taking meetings is a service, right? It's a service that you're delivering uh, uh, to clients, to customers uh, through the organization. And service is always a different area than production. If you buy a car, you don't go to the salesman to get your car serviced. You don't even meet with them probably. You might go into service and you might see the salesperson. You may even go over and say hi and go, man, I'm so glad I got this car. It's, it's awesome. It's everything I want, you know, um, but, but, but it's just not the norm, right? Service is a different area. You know, I really, really learned this when I uh, was in sales uh, at, um, uh, I sold minis for about a year and a half. I wanted to learn how to sell a higher end ticket. Um, I'd done a lot of assistant work, I'd worked in uh, all kinds of areas, um, but you know, felt that I needed more understanding of sales. I had done sales here and there, uh, for sure, and life is a sale, right? Um, you're sell or be sold, as Grant Cardone says, so you're always dealing with a sale, or whether you're selling or you're being sold. Um, but I learned so much there. And then also, this designation process, this tool, is something I learned when I was in business development for five and a half years for the number one marketing firm in marketing systems for financial advisors, that's Bill Good Marketing. And he discusses this, this is something he discusses publicly, so I'm not revealing any uh, intellectual property particularly, right? This is something he shares publicly. Um, and it was this, is that, that when, when the person, the demanding customer comes in for their meeting, you have the person you wanna designate the responsibility to in the meeting, and say they'll be attending the meeting. Uh, at the end of the meeting, you know, and during the meeting, meeting, you refer things to this person that you want to designate this service to um, as to do the follow-up, as to get this action, as to do this action. And then make sure that they are quickly follow up with the client uh, and they're uh, quick to ensure that things are going as planned. Right Now, the result of this um, is that eventually, when the client calls and they have an immediate need to be helped, they're gonna, if you pick, let's say you picked up the phone, which you shouldn't be doing, but if you were picking up the phone, you picked up the phone, they say, hey, oh, hey, great, you know, nice to reach you. But you know, uh, other than nice these, they, they go, I, I wanna talk to such and such a designee. You know, they're, they're awesome. Uh, in the meeting, you refer to how awesome this designee is. They're even better than you, which is often the case at this specific responsibility or why on earth are you hiring them? So that's the tool right there, is include the designee in calls, in meetings with the special client, and then refer to them as being awesome and to getting it done. And um, also ensure that uh, they do quick follow-up and maintain the follow-up to see the thing to an end result. And then it will be a natural transition for this, your most demanding customer, to no longer have to deal with you, but really to deal with this person and be happy to do it. All right, guys, um, use it. I hope you find that useful. I think you should, and uh, all the best to you on building your knowledge business. Bye, guys.